I'm gonna give you five steps to turning that dream into a reality. Uh, number one is you got to get really clear on what you want. What do you truly want? Not just the toys, the cars, and all that stuff, but what's the experiences you want to create? What are the things that you want? What do you when when your time is up and you're standing in front of God? What does He say to you? What does He say to you? He say, Hey, man, you did it right, or you could have done better. And really figure those things out. What do you want that experience to be? What do you want that life to look like? And then go do it, right? But once you define that, too many people are very loose with what they want and they don't truly understand it. So there's no real purpose or mission behind the things they do. So the very next thing that you wanna do, once you figure that out and you get real clear on that, is you have to pick a vehicle to make the money to be a lot to allow you to have those experiences and create that lifestyle to give the things that you want to give provide the experiences to your family or other people that you want to provide but you have to pick that vehicle now once you pick it you have to get rolling on it you got to decide all right there's so many well first let me say this there's a lot of different ways that you can do it you can do brick and mortar stores are a way restaurants all these different like standardized ways that people make money but you could also leverage the internet which is obviously a huge opportunity for many people to provide lifestyle the lifestyle that they want so you could build an e-com store you could build an information education company you could build many different things online a media company you could start your own agency so there's a lot of things that you could do and those are actually the ones i mentioned are some that we have done so once you do that once you decide what you want step two you have to pick a vehicle that's going to generate the money you need to live the life that you've chosen and decided you want step three is you have to execute you gotta execute like your life depends on it because frankly it does you've made the commitment so why would you not operate as if failure is not an option the challenge is so many people have this idea and they fall flat when it comes time to execute and because they don't execute they turn around and not realizing the dreams, then they feel like failures and then they don't get back on that damn horse and make things happen. So execute is huge. The next thing too is you have to, step four, you gotta adapt. The only constant in business and in life is change. So what you need to do is be able to adapt with the changes fa as fast as you recognize them, you need to adapt with them. So many people get stuck just doing the same thing over and over and over because it worked before that doesn't always mean it's going to work now so you the step four if you want to realize that you know create success you have to go ahead and adapt to the market changes and what's going on and then number five most important this is where a lot of people also fall short and i've fallen short here many many years over the year many times over the years but we've got it right now and what it is is you have to get your money making you money. So a lot of these companies become opportunities to generate cash flow. And once you have cash flow, what happens, you have two things you can do with it. You can go spend it or you can invest it. And many people that go spend it end up constantly on this hamster wheel of just cash flow, cash flow, cash flow, right? Whereas in turn, if you start taking some a portion of that cash flow that you got and investing it so it makes you more money, that gives you an opportunity to actually have passive cash flow. And now that can be done in a couple of different ways. A great way that people are doing it right now is e-com stores. There's companies you can partner with to turn around and actually, you know, build this passive cash flow. Real estate is another opportunity, right? That's passive cash flow, that has appreciation, and everything else. So there's, there's a handful of different ways that you can do that, but that's the five steps right there for you to get started and realize success. If you gain value in this video, go ahead, like, comment, share, share it with someone that's gonna gain some value as well. Thank you for watching, appreciate it.